how to win every single natural type race even if you're typing five words per minute it doesn't matter how fast you type using this idea you would win literally every single natural type race 100 percent of the time however in the process of making this idea we have hit a rock wall it's and it's kind of i can't get past that rock wall so it decreases the chance to 75 percent but we almost had the idea and if we had the idea we would literally be able to win the national type races every single time even if you're typing slow it doesn't matter how fast you type but again we hit a wall and we can't get past it i'm still going to show you how i came up with this idea and how it works and everything um, and I'm also going to show you how you can use the 75% chance that we still have to win the races. So make sure you watch until the end. So in a natural type race there are 5 players including you. So there are 4 other players. And you have no control over who joins the race or when the race starts. The race will automatically start when there are 5 players. For this idea I need to have control over who joins and when the race starts and everything. So I would need to be in a friend race and I would need to be the host. In a friend race, the race automatically starts when 4 of your friends have joined your race or you can press start anytime you want and other players or bots will fill in for the gap or space there is left. So in the friend race mode, since I have control over who joins the race, so couldn't I just create 4 other accounts and make them join my race? Since those 4 accounts are racing, Nobody's going to be racing on them because I'm typing on the winning account and the other four accounts are just there to fill in the gap. So I have no competition because those four accounts are mine and they're just there to fill in the gap. It's just me racing. Now I think you see where I'm going with this. However, there is still some things that we need to get past, um, we need to fix and everything because just having those four accounts join my race, it will work but it's not going to work for long. Uh, and there will be other problems that come along with it. So when I first thought about this idea, I created just one account just to see if it worked and just as I expected it, it worked perfectly fine. However, I didn't really put much time and energy into it because it was just I was just trying to see if it worked and I discovered it would work. Since then, I've been meaning to work on it, but I just, I don't know, I, I forgot about it and I just hadn't had time and stuff. Um, so like, I forgot about it for like a while. When those four accounts join in, there are still other things, other problems that arise from the four accounts joining in. For example, if I'm racing on the winning account, nobody's racing on the other accounts, so the other accounts would be disqualified. And that's not going to be good because once those accounts are disqualified five times, then you'll have to wait five minutes for them to be undisqualified which is not what we're looking for at all. And to fix this, it was actually pretty simple. I just made a Temper Monkey script that would make the accounts join the next race. Or other way of saying that would be a script that would refresh the page of those accounts so they can join the next race. I don't know, I guess I just say the same thing. I don't know, but you'll see what I mean later. So now, those accounts will not be disqualified. Instead, what will happen is First of all, those four accounts are already in my race, so I can join my race anytime I want and when the race starts, those accounts would go to the next race because the pages of those accounts are refreshed, um, which would force them to go to the next race and wait for me to finish racing. And since those four accounts have filled in all the spots, I basically have no competition because those accounts are not even here and nobody's racing on them. So I basically have no competition right now because those four accounts are not racing. Nobody is typing on them or anything like that. They are just waiting for me on the next race. So while I'm racing, while I'm typing, those accounts would be waiting for me for the next race. And when I finish the race, I would be joined into the next race. And since those accounts are already on the next race, the race starts immediately when there are 5 players, so when I join it would be 5 players and now when I am doing that second race, those accounts would advance to the next race or the script would refresh the page for those accounts and those accounts would be waiting for me for the next race, waiting for me to finish typing and again since 
those accounts have filled in the spots i have no competition i have there are no bots or no other players typing so i basically have the game to myself i can go five words per minute if i want i can go i can type with 100 percent accuracy and 10 words per minute if i want i have the game to myself no competition at all and that's where the script becomes useful because without the script when the race starts, I would have to go refresh those pages so the accounts wouldn't be disqualified and that would be too much work and, and that's not what we're looking for. Alright, so now everything's figured out and everything's ready to go, everything's set up. And here's the first race. Okay, this is kind of the sad part. This is where we hit the wall, alright? This is where we hit the rock wall. Wait, actually, actually I think I'm saying this wrong. I think it's actually a brick wall. Yeah, I think I've been saying it wrong this whole time. Well, actually, I, I think it's I think a rock wall would be stronger though. You know, you know what I mean. But anyways, it doesn't matter. Um, but this is where we hit the brick wall. All right. So after everything set up and every problem was fixed, here's the first race. And as you just witnessed there, we can't get past that. The brick wall says you have to leave, you have to sacrifice one man and you're good to go. That means we still have a chance, alright? We we'll still have like a 75% chance. So basically what we would need to do is leave one of those accounts out. So sacrifice that account. So now I would have three of my accounts join my race. Which would mean that one other bot or other player would join my race. So I now I have one competitor. Uh, I, how do you say that? Competitor? Competitor? I don't know, but you would have a competition. And that would only be one player or bot. Now, would that be a 50% chance or a 75% chance? Because, I don't know, I think it would be a 75% chance because three of those accounts I don't know but I'm just gonna go with 75% so we still have a 75% chance Now if you want to try it out with the three players eliminated, this is how it works. 